Also new tonight, video from UIC police showing exactly how they were able to track down a killer. Yeah, it's the man they say killed UIC sophomore Ruth George. Our Charlie DeMar got his hands on that video and walks us through it. The horrific crime starts here. UIC police say Donald Thurman gets off the UIC Halstead Blue Line. That's him in the white puffy coat. Don't forget the jacket. It's a huge piece of evidence for detectives. Thurman makes his way up the ramp and out the doors to Halstead. He heads for Taylor Street. We're around the same time UIC sophomore Ruth George and a friend are getting out of a lift. They go separate ways. George heads for her car parked in a nearby campus garage. Thurman is seen on a series of cameras. Here, surveillance video from inside a campus building shows him walking by. And on another, you can see him moments before police say he kills. Prosecutors say Thurman catcalled and tried talking to George during the walk. She ignored it. It's grainy, but UIC police say that's George walking into the Taylor Street garage. All seems clear. But about 47 seconds later, remember that white coat? It reappears crossing the street. It's Thurman, police say, who goes into the garage, attacking George from behind, sexually assaulting and killing her, prosecutors say. Police spent the next several days following Thurman's travel patterns along the CTA. Here he is at the division stop. Ultimately, Thurman was arrested and charged in George's murder. Now, UIC police releasing that surveillance video in response to a freedom of information request that we put in. Police say that Thurman admitted to killing Ruth George in this garage shortly after he was arrested. We are live tonight from the UIC campus. Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. Brad and Erica. All right, Charlie, thank you.